Superman casting Mason. Mm -hmm. It's via the rap. So Mark Kent and Park Kent have both been cast. Mm -hmm. Mark Kent is Neva Hal, and Park Kent is Pruitt Taylor Vince. Sound like a couple of old folks. They do look like a couple of old folks. He I I recognize Mm -hmm. from a bunch of stuff, including the movie Identity with John Cusack. Okay. And other things. And I've got your identity, John Cusack. Yeah, man, we all know who I am. (laughs) Give it back though. I think looking at these two, though, they're definitely going for the folksy kind of... Absolutely. And, uh, like, uh, like older than, like, the previous as well, like, maybe potentially in their, like, 70s or 80s, you uh-huh. know? Yeah. Like, I mean, look at this. That's classic Martha Kent. That's a good Martha. Yep, absolutely, yeah. yeah. I'm loving this, yeah. man. They haven't gone with the Marissa Tomei, Aunt May stuff. No, that's... Right? Yeah, exactly, yeah. Which, you know, yuck. Why would you yeah. go with somebody that hideous? Oh. Obviously. Yeah. So, yeah, seems like a good choice. Looks great. They look heart attack ready. Also, they're alive. Because sometimes, and I think it's the same, is Superman birth, is it birthright? No, birthright. What are they basing one of these on? All-star Superman. Uh-huh. That's got something to do with this, right? Yeah. His parents are alive in that, aren't I they? I think so. Yeah. Often yeah. they are. Yeah, uh-huh. I think the most common interpretation of the Superman mythos is they are yeah, so that's what they did in the '80s when they rebooted Superman. They're like, "Well, his parents are dead, but it'd be nice if he had parents, his parents, and like you know, even though he's super powerful, he he, he wants- can go home and be like, God, that was I got punched so hard by a robot.' And they're well, like, Clark, have you considered punching that robot even harder? <laughs> Thanks, Dad. <laughs> you always got the wisdom for me. <laughs> yeah, that's a classic. Scene. That's a good good scene. You remember? I think yeah, movie and. Often live action Superman. Not always. Dean Cain one wasn't. I think he, he always ends up dying. He yes, does uh-huh. at the very least. The park park end. Yeah. Yes. I think it's the new Superman and Lois. They're both dead. I think it starts that Martha Kent had just died at the yeah. start. That's why they moved to Smallville. Yeah, yeah. it's Something. in the intro. Mm. Martha Kent's just died, and it's time <laughs> to go back to Smallville. Bow, 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 bow. Mm-hmm. Uh, this is by THR. Shadow the Hedgehog in Sonic the Hedgehog three's voice has been revealed. Was and it Idris Elba? No, it's Keanu Reeves. No, he's Knuckles the Hedgehog. Okay, I don't know. <laughs> he's Knuckles the Echidna. Okay. All right. Yeah. Uh, so that's cool. Okay, now, was Shadow the Hedgehog? He's the one with the gun. Yeah, I know he's the one with the gun, but was he revealed in Sonic 2? Yes, man. Sonic the Hedgehog 2, the movie. And Jim Carrey is also back because he was like, I'm retiring from movies. Are you Tarantino? <laughs> Are you right. really? Yes. But he's going to play Dr. Robotnik. Okay. Um, which is mostly just they filmed Jim Carrey in a green screen and he just like dabs and and thrusts about. Absolutely, And then yeah. they put Sonic in later or whatever. That's right. Yeah. So, you know, why not get $5 million to do that for a couple of days? Yeah, that's right. Put on a mustache and a bald cap. Good on you. Uh, Keanu Reeves, though. I like it. Good choice. They're pretty solid kids' movies. Yeah, that's right. Uh, they're just, they are what they are, uh-huh. which is something we'll probably talk about later as well. Okay, right. Do you yeah. think he's going to use his iconic line, guns, lots of guns? Yes, I'm Shadow the Hedgehog? <laughs> yes, definitely. Oh, that's so too. Guns. Lots of guns. Yeah, I uh, I think they're also better movies than the Mario movie. Having only seen the first Sonic, I agree. Yeah. And it's about friendship and whatever. It's about friendship or whatever. Yeah. That's why THR. One Punch Man. You know this movie's happening, don't you? Now Live I action do. Movie. Now I do. Uh, it's going to be directed by Justin Lin. We already knew that mm-hmm. of f- f- fame. Yes. Fast and Furious. <laughs> franchise, yeah. Fast and Furious franchise. Fan. Now, it appears, Rick and Morty creator and co-executive producer Heather Ann Campbell and Dan Harmon will pen the project. Well, well, well. I only got a little bit into One Punch Man season two and I'm like, I don't, this has lost me, I think. Okay. Season one is spectacular. Uh-huh. What lost, lost you it. in the second season? It's just not great. Okay. Then. Not as funny. Mm-hmm. Animation's not as good. Yeah. More fighting? I don't know. More focused on the fight? I have no idea. Okay. I don't remember. I remember the first season like very well, but the second one, not as Interesting, much. Interesting. Okay. Yeah. It's a great show. And there might be a third season at one point. I don't know. So there you go. One Punch Man, Western adaptation of an anime. Still no star attached. No. We need the most average man alive. Uh, what's that dude? Uh, uh, he plays um, uh, Jimmy Woo. Oh, Randall Park. Yeah, man. He's too handsome. We've discussed Shave his head. It's fine. Shave his head and his eyebrows. He'd look weird. <laughs> okay, that would work, I guess. He'd yeah. Look weird, Mason. Oh, uh-huh, yeah. Yeah. You want somebody like Toby Maguire, but obviously not Toby Maguire. Like obviously. The, like the blandest man you can imagine. Absolutely. But Asian. Mm. Yeah. So I don't know. Yeah. I don't know where you go with that. We'll certainly, we'll, we'll soon we'll find out. Do you think he's even going to be Asian? Do you think they're going to westernize this? Yes. I think he'll okay. definitely be Asian. Interesting. And okay. like, yeah, you probably should, you know? But, you know, I'm sure a lot of people have a Scarlett Johansson. Uh, what if Black Panther was white, though? Yeah, what if? 
What about Emma Stone from that movie? That's a good idea. That's right. Yeah. All right. That's good stuff probably. I don't know.